Welcome back to Math Dogs. If you're new to the channel, please comment, like, and subscribe. If you have any questions, please comment down below. Problem number six is subtracting mixed numbers. It says Cypress is using ribbon to make dog bows. She has seven and three-fifths yards of red ribbon and cuts off two and a half yards to make the bows. How many yards of red ribbon does she have left? So does she have left indicates that we're going to be subtracting. So I have seven and three-fifths yards minus two and one-half yards. And like we did before, we're going to rewrite these as fractions. Five times seven is 35, plus three is 38 back over five, so 38 fifths, minus two times two is four, plus one is five halves. And now I need to find a common denominator in order to subtract them. Since five and two are both prime numbers, all you have to do is multiply the two numbers together. So five times two is 10. That's a trick for finding a common denominator. If the two numbers are prime numbers, multiply them together and you'll always have your least common denominator. Now I'm going to rename the numerators. Five times what number is 10? Well, obviously it's two, so I'm gonna multiply by the form of one, two over two. So my new numerator, two times 38, is 76. So 38 fifths is the same thing as 76 tenths. For the second fraction, two times what number is 10? That was five, so I'm gonna multiply by the form of one, five over five, and five times five is 25. So five over two is the same thing as 25 over 10. And now all I have to do is subtract. 76 tenths minus 25 tenths, I'll subtract the numerators. 76 minus 25 is 51, and we put that back over 10. And now I can rewrite that in mixed number form. 10 divides into 51 how many times? Five full times will give me 50, and when I subtract, I have a remainder of one out of 10. So 51 over 10, 10 divides into 51 five full times, and I have a remainder of one out of 10. So that means Cypress has five and one tenth yard of red ribbon left. 